I'm Julian Dawes, and they say I cleaned up Miami. Yes, I've cleared the decks of a few bad apples, but I had a lot of help. Now, I've been a police officer my entire adult life. And as much as it pains me to admit it, I've come to realize that the way we do police work, especially drug enforcement, is dangerously outdated. With your investment, together we can forge the new future of law enforcement. Our old captain's been busy. Jeez. Cleaned up Miami? Get this. They're calling Dawes America's police chief. Where the hell is that from, anyway? An angel investor pitch video. You ever heard of preferred outcomes? No. Well, you will. Dawes thinks privatized law enforcement is the future. Preferred outcomes is his way of cornering the market. <laughs> I changed my mind. Take me back to prison. Maybe later. First this. Car dealership? Nope. Korean mafia front, and Dawes is involved. I assume you have proof of that? No, but we've got a guy on the inside. His name's Boomer. He's kind of a freelance IT guy for scumbags. You two will pick him up near the dealership. He'll have all the information we need to take Dawes down. Remind me again why I should trust you? Because you're the only one who hates Dawes more than I do. Guy Boomer's an hour late, Kai. He's not picking up. That means something's wrong. Without him, we get no info on Dawes. Well, not necessarily. You want us to break in? Is anyone still inside? Call my wife till I be late. Can you do that without fucking it up? They're out. Then, yeah, I think you need to break in. Look, they've got to have sales records, bio info, credit ratings, I don't know. Everything I've learned about this place is rotten. You just need to find that computer. The thumb drive should be able to crack the password and get the files. In and out, simple. Right? Definitely would not buy a car from that dude. And Nick, keep an eye out for Boomer, okay? He's a good kid. We'll do what we can. So what, we're babysitters now? Just park near the dealership. Someplace dark. You know, I haven't actually robbed a place in probably 20 years. <laughs> Don't worry. Here it's just like riding a bike. Someone who doesn't give a shit about selling cars. If it's online, it's not the one we're looking for.
It's this one. All right, Kai. This better work. Well, shit. You must have tripped the silent alarm. Yeah. And those aren't cops. They're coming in. Check over there. Go to look around. Spread out. Keep looking. Someone's here. Find him. Search everywhere. Tyson, we're about to get a second helping. So, you enjoying your first day as a free man? Between prison and this, I'll take this. Here they come! Yeah, you learn a couple useful things as a cop. <laughs> Speaking of which, your old pals are on their way. Shit. Simple, she said. In and out, she said. Heads up! Heads up! Nick! That thing's got a minigun! Nick! That thing's got a minigun! We're out the drive! Nick! Get this fuck! We gotta go! Now! Nick! Watch that door! Get back! Oh shit! What the hell? Look out!
Jesus Christ, that was nuts! Kai, we got the files. Heading back now. Not yet. We still need to find Boomer. Are you fucking kidding me? He was working at Kang's scrapyard. It's nearby. I can't decrypt those files without him. Kai, these dealership guys? They're still after us. Look, you want to hurt Dawes? This is step one. Got it? Yeah, got it. We'll be in touch. Gotta give the lady what she wants. Pull up over there. Let's find this boomer person. I'll get a look inside. Can you spot me? On it. All right, I'm in place. At least five or six guys in there. Looks like an alarm, too. How you want to handle this, officer? Let me guess. Boomer. Oh, man. Thank you. You're Kai's friend, right? Kai's friend? Not even close. What the hell happened to you? You know those files that Kai asked me to get? They caught me trying to download them. They were gonna put you in a car crusher? You know that whole criminal psychopath thing? These dudes method act that shit, man. But you got the files, right? Of course I did. Come on, they're in my laptop, which is in my car, which is... on the other side of that warehouse, which is filled with guards. Fuck! The safest place for you is inside this trunk. What? No, 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 no way, Kimosabi. I'm coming with. I'll be right back. I promise. Dude, you can't even get in the warehouse without my key card. Hey! Thanks. Hey! No, no, no. Hey! Man! Hey, don't be part of the problem, man! Hey, hey! I'm not cool! I'm not cool, man! Not cool! Keep watch while I'm in this warehouse. Anyone else shows up, I'll let you know.
Tyson, grabbing the kid's laptop. Like he split. I want my laptop. 
I thought I told you to wait in the trunk. Let's discuss later, yeah? Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Get around them! Go left, left, left! Keep going! <laughs> Do not stop! Was awesome. Let's talk about why an army was guarding a salvage yard. You saw the drugs? What drugs? The cars. Give this man a prize. They're taking apart stolen cars, lining them with drugs, putting them back together, and, and selling them to the dealership. God, I wish I'd thought of that. It's Kang's dealership. Trains bring in the stolen cars, cars from all over. Kang fills the cars with drugs. Dawes' guys run the trains. Dawes' guys? Really? Yeah, the trains unload right next to Kang's chop shop. I mean, it's not that far. You guys want to check it out? Let's go put this Mr. Kang out of business. Sure, why not? It's been a pretty quiet day so far. All right. The heart of the operation's up here. This better be worth it. As long as it hurts Dawes, it's worth it. So, who's this Kang guy? Runs downtown LA, likes <laughs> people in car crushers, has a hot wife. 
pays well. Except for the car pressure thing, he sounds okay. He's also the center of Dawes' early operation. He goes down, Dawes is out of front. Hit the mother load. That's 9.9 .9 million dollars worth of coke. Uh, what are you, drug rain man? Come on, let's leave it for the cops. I'm not letting cops take this. Then what are you gonna do with it? We're in Los Angeles. I can unload this in six days. What am I talking about? I know a pro basketball player. Four days. Tyson, I'm not kidding. Let's go. I'm getting this out of here. You can help me if you like. Forklift goes like zero miles an hour. You'll get to Hollywood by next week. Oh, 
Come on! Hey, nice. I'm not blind. Oh, then what are you doing? This goddamn thing, I'm almost free. Well, maybe you get the hell out of it! Tyson, goddammit, get behind and push! Come on! Not a word. <laughs>